Good evening. This study focused on 15 people who have been hospitalized with respiratory or ambulatory viral infections and their long term immune response. As most people know, it has been a scramble of late to get boosted or get a test. I was recently exposed. Uh, my best friend actually contracted it and we both are fully vaccinated. Dean Adamson of Seattle struggled today to find a solution in Soto. Just got my booster three weeks ago. Which may be good news if you believe new research from the University of Washington. The study suggests getting a booster and having a breakthrough COVID case elicits similar immune reactions. The study from the Department of Biochemistry set out to examine the strength of antibody responses and found that people who were boosted, suffered from a breakthrough, or were vaxxed after initial infection had more potent and lasting reaction than those who only had two shots or didn't get vaccinated at all. Both the State Department of Health and Seattle King County Public Health leaders declined to comment on the findings today, and Adamson didn't take anything for granted. I think everybody should get tested whether they they want it or not. I mean, it's for your own safety as well as others. The faster you get vaccinated, the faster we can return to normality, if that's what you want to call it. Dr. Jeff Duchin with the Seattle King County Health Department did said in King 5 a lengthy statement late this afternoon, which read in part that it was an important but small study of people. And in his words, if this finding is confirmed by other studies, it may ultimately be useful in exploring alternative vaccine schedules. But he stressed, now quoting, this study does not mean a past COVID-19 infection alone is as good as vaccination in protecting from future COVID-19 infections. That is the story for now in Seattle. I'm Chris Daniels, King 5 News.